Excuse me. Is this Rose Lane garage? Yeah. You don't want to take her out, miss, do you? No, I... I just want to look at her. She's a good friend of mine. Caravan? Yes. Spruce. We ain't touched her since the Blitz. What happened to the tires? Requisition. You know the regulations. Mr. Portal couldn't let you know because he had no address for you. He got the receipt. He'd be glad you're here. I'll go and tell him. What a shame. I knew I should find you here. I know how you're feeling. You don't. Everybody has disappointments in life. Life is full of disappointments. The moths are eating everything. I don't want to hurt your feelings. But there's something impermanent about a caravan. Everything on wheels must be on the move sooner or later. Hello, Mr. Portal. How are you? How do you do, Miss Allison? How do you do? Do you know Mr. Culpepper? Oh, yes, I know Mr. Culpepper. I knew his father. How do you do, Mr. Tom? How are you, Mr. Portal? Miss Allison, why didn't you leave us your address? Two weeks ago, Mr. Jeffrey's father came here. He came here all the way from Oxford. He didn't want the caravan. He can't have it. It was Mr. Jeffrey's wish that I should have it. When you were a witness, you were there when he said no, it. No, 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 it's quite all right, Miss Allison. He doesn't want the caravan. He wants to get in touch with you. I told him that we'd received a letter from you and that you were coming here. He's waited for you. He's staying at the Falstaff. For over two weeks now, he's waited for you here in Canterbury. Why? Because he has news, Miss Allison. Official news about Mr. Jeffrey. He's in Gibraltar. Miss Allison. I must open the windows. The caravan's full of moss. They're ruining everything. Where's Mr. Culpepper? He's gone, Miss Allison. 